I want to tell you about the $50 gig that changed my life. I'm Fernando Perdomo, and when I was 21 years old, I was living in my hometown of Miami, Florida, and um, I was trying to make a living playing guitar, taking any gig that I could possibly get while also working on my own music, playing in bands, and going to college. Um, one of the first gigs that I got was playing guitar on some demos for a songwriter named Nicholas Tovar. Nicholas was, is incredibly talented and uh, has written some incredible songs over the years. And he um, hired me pretty much at 50 bucks a song to come in and play guitar on his demos. And uh, this was around 2002. And uh, one of the songs I remember, I, I remember coming in for the session at a place called Crescent Moon Studios in Miami and bringing my main guitar at the time, which is my 1982 Fender Telecaster. And uh, I also brought my 78 Les Paul. And I brought my pedal board and I brought my Ampeg Verberocket tube amp. I remember him saying, what's all this? And I'm like, well, this is my usual recording rig. And he's like, oh, man, you could just use my pod. And I'm like, well, I, I lugged it over here. We might as well mic it up and have some fun. So we did. And I recorded like six songs that day. And uh, it was really fun coming up with parts for these songs and really kind of making them, they're pretty much making them my own. Um, well... About a month later, I got a phone call from Nicholas saying that one of the songs had been picked by a famous Mexican artist named Christian Castro to be his new single. The better news was he loved my guitar playing so much that he pulled my guitars off the demo and put it on the master. This is the lesson I want to teach today. Bring your A game, whether you're playing a cheap session, expensive session, playing at a coffee house or playing at a stadium. You never know what's going to come from it. And you never know who's going to be there and who's going to be listening. Um, this little guitar part that I laid down on this song ended up on the track. Uh, the album came out um, called Amares. The single went top 10. The album went platinum. Uh, what ended up happening was he liked my playing so much on the single that he had me come in and play guitar on most of the record. The album was produced by Emilio Stefan, came out uh, in 2000, early 2003, and it went platinum. And then I ended up touring the world with Christian. And it was an incredible experience. And uh, what can I say? Um, thank you, Christian, for the experience. Thank you, Nicholas, for believing in me and bringing me in, this 21-year-old guitar player playing on these demos. And um, it started off my career, and uh, now I'm about to turn 40, and I've been doing this for about 20 years, and uh, I this is what I see myself doing for the rest of my life. So to all the young guitar players, to all the struggling guitar players, to all the people that are just making ends meet, you never know what your next break is going to be. So bring your A game, whether you're getting paid 50 or double scale.